modify your new Midwest brand can with the easy leak proof quick flow spout that is still no good the spout on these new ones is terrible you got a little red thing you gotta push down snap then you gotta hold it with your thumb a lot of pressure pour it gas starts peeing out over here I hate it yeah you can buy one of these little whatever it is easy pour kits I have one somewhere around here or you take this thing apart flat, small flathead screwdriver or a piece of plastic don't pinch the o-ring what you're gonna have to do is put a lot of pressure push down on this or you can use your hand this o-ring right here seals it you gotta take that o-ring off but save it you see you need a hard surface push this down on a hard surface hard surface get this out of the way get some of my junk out of the way push down bam o-ring work it off don't break it o-ring all right now be careful There's a spring underneath here going to want to fly off take the whole thing off see the spring getting rid of that thing this gone spring gone put it back together if you take it apart like that you know you can just put it back together it's thinking about drilling over over here too so it's constant flow might do it might not again it's gonna always leak out around here unless there's o-ring around here which they don't put which they should all right snap it back push that back notice no spring tension now it's nice o-ring back on because you need that o-ring no o-rings there when you pull it you know that's your stopper right there it's stopping it you see it still works as designed it's going to seal mostly tight hit it do it look you can pour it now if you put this back on well, make sure you don't screw up that rubber seal either you can put it back on, hold on, collar, bam, gas can, put your doodle, doodler back on, there you go, any way you want, put it that way if you care to, look at that, done pouring, want to pour, push it, pour, wow, use a funnel though, again, it's going to piss out over here, but there we go, so much easier making it more practical than this stupid freaking thing you gotta hold it's terrible so I'm glad I decided to take that apart these springs look how heavy duty that is they could have went with a thinner spring that's a pretty heavy tension spring maybe you can even if you want to keep the spring go to a hardware store find a lighter gauge spring but this is too thick for me there we go modified the can it's like 90 times better without having to buy one of those fancy kits what you can also do is drill a hole put a vent in it which I do have a vent kit might do that but there you go now your new Midwest can it's like 10 times better with the spring removed or easier to operate but it's try not child proof now and you're going to start a fire and you defeated the purpose you can hear the comments now people get a life I bought it. I could do whatever the hell I want with it. Or maybe you can't these days in this country. So that's that. Like the video. Subscribe if you want. Modify your gas can if you care to. But again, know that this is going to piss. Right here. It's going to leak. So always use a funnel when you pour fuel into a car. Use a long skinny funnel with a wider mouth though than this. This is... Yeah. I use a big transmission fluid funnel but that works fine going down the chute that little flapper door have a good one modify your can if you want